so extreme, I'm the super like laser beams. Get right with the shell shack pizza games. Can't stop these radical dudes. Good morning, Naka. Happy Halloween. Boys and girls, I'm getting the perfect Halloween breakfast for us. We have Reese's, M&M's, Hershey's, Kit Kats. You just can't go wrong. And when you're an Ninja Turtle, you can just eat pretty much anything you want. Well, boys and girls, today is Friday, October 30th. Let's please stand for the pledge, which is recited by Zoe. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, thank you, Zoe, you did a fantastic job. Be sure, if you would like to do the pledge, to complete the form which is on our NACA website. Today is our last day of Red Ribbon Week. Thank you to everyone for taking part in Drug and Alcohol Prevention Week. Hope you have enjoyed the activities and all the fun dress up days to help you remember that you are NA or NACA NACA too smart to start. Stay at drug and alcohol and tobacco free. We had two fifth graders send some pictures they created. Look at these that remind us about Red Ribbon Week and making good choices. Thanks guys, these are great reminders. All right, boys and girls, today's national days. Today's national days are National Checklist Day, Candy Corn, and Breadstick Days. So, hmm, we got Breadstick, Candy Corn, and National Checklist. And I thought that would be perfect for NACA meeting that it's October 30th, so it's almost Halloween. And checklists, we've learned all about checklists and agendas especially at NACA and how important those are to keep us organized to make sure you get what you need. So, happy checklist day. That leads us right into our Wonderopolis. And I was wondering, can you grow candy corn? So, go to www.wonderopolis.com and type in, can you grow candy corn? Hmm, I actually hate candy corn, but yeah, we'll see. All right, another big thank you to everyone who came to Consumable Pickup on Wednesday. We'd love to see so many of you in our Halloween costumes. Check out some of these pictures. fantastic costumes thank you also I it was just amazed a big thing thank you to everyone who brought in food to to be donated I am um, actually headed to McKnight today and I am um, gonna take some pictures and see how much is actually there but it kept coming in and coming in so a big big thank you to everyone also a reminder our students who are transitioning back to in-person instruction next Wednesday Make sure you bring with you your Go Math books. If uh, you're in kindergarten through second grade, your social studies books and your my books. So kindergarten has one. If you are in first, second, three through five, you have your into reading my books. Make sure you bring them to school with you on November 4th as, as well as your iPad. All right, so we are almost at the end of the quarter and I wanted to share some amazing things that are happening because I feel like we are just getting started at NACA. All right, let's start out with these amazing artists. Check out 
these awesome haunted houses, black cats and NACA tigers. Mrs. Hagerman and Miss Jackson, you should be so, so proud of these amazing artists at NACA. Mrs. Kozeski had a fifth grader who was hoping to give us a challenge. Check out this challenge and see if you are up to it. Hi everyone, I'm Smriti Siddharth. I'm in fifth grade and my homeschool is MES. I have a challenge for you all and the challenge is a scenery drawing challenge. You can only use a maximum of four colors to color your drawing. Even though you can only use four colors, Try to make your drawing as colorful as possible. You can use many different materials to outline or color your drawing. Just make sure you are using four colors or less. To submit your drawings, email a picture of them to Mrs. Kozeski. Her email is on the screen. Make sure your picture is nice, neat, and can be seen. Take a picture on a table, maybe. If you want to make sure your drawing is your best possible work, try doing a rough draft first and then doing your final copy. Have fun creating and enjoy! I love it. Well, make sure you follow the directions. We would love to see if you are able to take this challenge. All right. And Team Kindness in fourth grade wrapped up the first nine weeks with a very cool project. They chose a story that was written in third person and transformed it into first person. Watch this clip. <laughs> and I'm going to tell you the story of my life. In the beginning, there were three colors, reds, yellows, and blues. The reds were the loudest. Yellows were the brightest. And us, the blues, were the coolest. Hi, my name is Hope. I was born deep in the ocean. I knew early that I was different from the other narwhals. My tusk was as long as ever in Alice's. I had different tastes in food. And I was a very good swimmer. done. Spike and I only had the old house to visit. Let's go, I cried. Let's not, I said. It's too spooky. But Seymour had already scurried up to the old house ahead of us. We have to find Seymour. I will be Kirsty, the person in black hair. Dear Diary, it's me, Kirsty, remember? So, today we helped find Ruth the Red Riding Hood Fairy's magic basket. Yay! Little Red Riding Hood. I have no idea why people call me that. I think it's because Grandma knitted a red cloak for me and I wear it very often. Wait, people call me that so much, I forgot my real name. Amazing. I got to pop into one of the Google Meets and I was just amazed. It was so creative. So there's so many great things happening at NACA and I'm excited to see again what the second nine week brings. All right. Mr. Gillis is our good night NACA reader this week. He is reading The Golden Acorn, which is a book all about teamwork. And we know even at NACA, even not maybe physically being with each other, how important it is to work together. So make sure you check that out. That'll be on our website as well as on our Facebook page. As we're talking about reading, we have a book review from Pranitha in fourth grade. My name is Pranitha and this is one of my favorite books, A Wrinkle in Time by Madeline. 
I recommend this book if you love time travel. It was a winner of 1963 Newbery Medal. Pranitha, that book sounds amazing. I think there was a, a movie. I know last week we talked about time traveling, but I would love to read that as well. So boys and girls, if you are interested in time tra traveling, make sure you check that story out. We are also going to be starting another segment called NACA Around the World. This segment, we will be learning about the students of NACA and their traditions, cultures, and heritage. Today's feature is Naeem. On the day of Eagle Fritter, we wear new clothes and we get presents. We also have parties and yummy food. Naeem, thank you so much for sharing. All right, I think everyone's favorite segment is a joke from Dr. McGahee. Check it out. It's the time of the day. What is Frankenstein's favorite type of car? A monster truck. Because <laughs> he's a monster. You are just too much, Dr. McGahey. All right, tech update. We're going to save it for next week because we've had a lot of videos today and it is a pretty good one. So I want to make sure that your full attention is on it and it's just too exciting of a day. All right, so have a spectacular Friday. Please be safe if you are going outside to trick or treat and have a great Friday. Bye, Naka.